masterpiece of the American folk artist and Quaker pastor, Edward Hicks. And it was inspired by Isaiah the prophet's vision of this perfect world. It was inspired by our reading today. So what do we see here? Well, in the foreground, we see a petting zoo of all of these different kinds of animals, some of them domestic and some of them are wild, and they're all sitting around and having this wonderful little picnic together. On the right, we see, as we see in the other Peaceful Kingdom series, images of the biblical prophecy from the book of Isaiah, chapter 11, verses 6 to 9, okay, which is the prophecy of God's mission to Jerusalem through a Messiah will come to earth and bring the people and the animals of the world together. And so there will be... In his numerous versions of the Peaceable Kingdom, Hicks showed the biblical prophecy that the lamb and the leopard will lie down with the kid and a little child shall lead them. In the background, the colony's founder, William Penn, is signing a treaty with the Delaware Indians. Tolerance really mattered to the Quakers, as it didn't to the Puritans.